What's up guys? My name is Cody and I want to welcome you to my YouTube channel. In today's video, you're going to find out what are the top 5 rookies in Madden 18. This video is going to be giving you my opinion on the best 5 rookies for you to use in Madden 18. And number 5 on our list is the running back from LSU, the first round pick for the Jacksonville Jaguars, and that is Leonard Fournette. Now, I felt like he had to get a top 5 mention, even though I really truly think that Leonard Fournette is going to be a bust in Madden. He will be good for the first couple of weeks because that's what Madden does. They normally take those top players and they make them really, really effective for the first couple of weeks. Anyways, I, I don't know. We'll see with Leonard Fournette. The, the offense is certainly going to be centered around him, so we'll see what happens. But in my opinion, Leonard Fournette is going to be uh, probably a top five rookie for the first couple of weeks, and then he will quickly fade out of the picture uh, just because, in my opinion, there's just not enough, haven't seen enough for Fournette yet to really believe uh, in what he brings to the table. All right, so the number four pick on our top five rookies in Madden 18 is the defensive end from Texas A&M. And that's because I, in Madden, it's hard to pick a defensive end as a dominant player. Like, even as good as J.J. Watt is, he is not normally known for being a dominant Madden player. Uh, however, uh, I felt obligated to at least give this guy a mention because of his athleticism, the fact that he was the number one overall pick, and that is the uh, defensive end for the Cleveland Browns, Miles Garrett. This guy is six foot five, can run like a racehorse. He is just a phenomenal pass rusher. I think he's going to be very effective as a user player as well. If you can, you know, finagle your defense to kind of get him at middle linebacker or something like that. He is just going to, I'm telling you guys right now, he is going to be a phenomenal star in the NFL. Uh, you want to kind of keep notice on the name A, or excuse me, Miles Garrett. Uh, even though he may not be the best Madden player, um, in my opinion, because defensive ends are not normally known for being a top tier Madden player, he is going to be one of the better players drafted in NFL history. He is a phenomenal, phenomenal player. So look, I'm going to look out for him. He is certainly a player that you're going to want to look at going forward. All right, so, uh, and then uh, real quick, guys, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to subscribe as we look into our number three overall on our top five rookies, and that is Patrick Mahomes. And the reason I picked Patrick Mahomes, probably more than any reason, is because of the team he's going to and the, and the potential he has for, uh, for Madden. Uh, you know, this guy is a gunslinger. He is uh, truly a great example of what it means to be a Texas A&M, or excuse me, a Texas Tech quarterback in that, you know, run and shoot style spread offense. And so the way it's going to translate to Madden is he's going to be able to have a really a solid arm and coming to a team that already is built uh, to really be a, a phenomenal playoff team every single year. And what this guy's going to be able to do after just using him a couple times in Mutt and kind of just watching him in the preseason, uh, he's going to be able to come into a team that already has a lot of talent around it. And now they have the quarterback that's going to be needed to make them successful. So I would look out for, for him. Uh, that's why he's on our number three on our list and our top five rookies for Madden 18. Number four, or excuse me, number two on our list. Now, this is a guy that I don't think we all know, but I think we all should know. Um, and th his name is Corey Davis. Corey Davis is, in my opinion, built like Randy Moss. He is 6'4". He can run flat, I mean, you know, f you know, really, really fast 40 time. Just a phenomenal athlete. But even better than that, he's a great receiver. Um, something that you're, you know, the Tennessee Titans are lacking. And so he's going to be able to come in and really be the guy from the beginning uh, for Marcus Mariota. And that offense is already... Very, very, very powerful with DeMarco Murray and Derrick Henry and Mar Mariota. And now with the addition of Corey Davis, I truly believe that that makes the Tennessee Titans offense one of the better young offenses in the, in the game. You know, obviously not as good as the Dallas Cowboys, but uh, I do believe that he is going to come in. Corey Davis and make a big time impact. And you're going to want to get him in your in your franchise drafts and things like that. Because, again, he's six foot four. He can really change the game you know, from an offensive standpoint. So I really, truly believe that you guys want to keep a, keep an eye out for uh, for Corey Davis. He, he really is a force to be reckoned with. He's going to be a phenomenal player for the Tennessee Titans. He's got a good head on his shoulder. He's going to be a good football player uh, in the years to come. The And then the number one player on our list. So we, we, we've kind of gone all over the place, but has mainly kind of stayed 
offensive for the majority of this. And I was going to put Jabril Peppers in this list. He's kind of an honorable mention. So if you guys would, you know, I think he's certainly someone. The Cleveland Browns did have a very good draft, in my opinion. They drafted some critical players that are going to be good for them for years to come. But number one on our list, I couldn't not put this guy on the list. And I, I just feel like he's going to make the biggest impact when you're talking about Madden. And that's John Ross. Um, John Ross, for, he was drafted by the Cincinnati Bengals, I believe. He just brings so much to the table when we talk about speed. Um, he is one of the fastest 40. I mean, he is just, he is freakishly athletic, freakishly fast, can just do so much. And I'm just telling you right now, this guy is a deep bomb ready to happen. He's Brandon Cooks, uh, but in my opinion, he's a little bit faster than Brandon Cooks was. So this guy is, is my number one player just because of the difference and the impact he's going to be able to have immediately coming to the Bengals, who already have A.J. Green, who already have, um, you know, a really solid, really really good foundation offensively. I truly look for this to be a breakout season for the Bengals with the addition of John Ross, someone who can truly outrun people, just burn, uh, you know, just burn rubber out there. He's just so fast and, in my opinion, just going to be something that you really want to look into as we look into this Madden 18 season Pick up John Ross, get him on your roster. He will change the game. He is one of the fastest players uh, to ever play the game by far. And I certainly, certainly plan on seeing a lot of highlights from him this season. So that wraps up our top five rookies in Madden 18. If you enjoyed this video, then do me a favor and share it with a friend. Just find somebody that you you know that enjoys Madden. You don't even have to know him. It could be somebody you play with. But share this video with one friend. And uh, that way they can kind of see what we're doing over here. And if they like the channel or if you are new to the channel, then subscribe and get access to more of our content, more of our tips, more of our tricks as we look forward to this Madden 18 season. Thanks, guys.